Hey, welcome to Timber Tuesday. One of the benefits, uh, again, this tractor, the bin is small as it is, but it acts like a lot bigger tractor, is that it has such lift capacity that I can lift, you know, these two bigger logs on the front at the same time. And still be narrow enough that I can put a big log down this side. I can put a, an actual probably 24, 25 inch log down this side and it scoots the tractor over and still be okay. So let's get this thing off. Slow and steady. You guys can see my ramps back here. We're gonna have to have some new ramps. That's 474 with a backhoe. Put a hurting on my ramps. Made them moon shape. All right, here we go. So we'll be real gentle here, not damage our trailer. I'm gonna roll this over just a little bit, hopefully not to the other side. See if I can. All right, it's gonna work. Little tractor got some strong hydraulics. I was just looking at my uh, hour meter on this little tractor. Now we, we did about 30 hours of testing on the demo 264 and we just turned over 30 hours on this uh, T264. That's 30 hours of seat time in this tractor. And either, out of both tractors, we had zero issues with the, with the tractors. And uh, I really feel like this one is going to uh, do well. It just just feels tight. So anyway, we're going we're gonna to finish up this other log, and uh, then we'll get to this maple. All right, so we're back out here. We're going to do a little maintenance before we get started, make sure our oils are on time. Let's see here. Spot on. So I have not, it's not burning one, one bit of oil. Gas is good, tank water's good. Now we're going to, uh, in the, like I said, when I put it away, I go ahead and uh, take the pressure off of this. So basically, as soon as you touch the spring, five full turns, so that's one, two, three, four, five. And then that makes your blade uh, enough tension on your blade. So that looks good. Also, in the evenings when I put it away, I read the, to take the tension off of this. So this, these little cables are not holding the weight of the head up all the time while you're gone. So here we go. Now what I'm gonna do, I don't remember the height uh, from the other day because we left here in a hurry with that rainstorm if you guys remember our last video So we're gonna go ahead and knock this one uh, Board out here, let's see here. We're cutting one inch So I'm gonna come down here and just set it on top that should jog my memory uh, Okay, I'll get it. Uh, let's see here So that's on seven so my next cut will be on six all right, putty knife. Gotta get putty knife out of the way. All right, we got the old choke on. Now this hadn't been started in a day or two since we were coming flying out here for the rain. Oh wait, I gotta turn it on. I keep doing it. I forget turning it. Forget to turn it on. Seems to be first pull every time that I turn it on. Right, I'm gonna sit here and let it run for just a minute and warm up. I could put a little, a little bit of a, a board here, not mar this up, but this is pretty much just a test board for us. And honestly, I don't think this is going anywhere. So let's see. Motor's been running for a little bit. Let's see what happens. It's gonna be a one inch.
All right, I don't have the cam dog. And then what that cam dog will do is like, like it'll let you lock in really low so you can cut down to a one inch board. I have, uh, I, don't, I just have the regular setup right now. I don't have that extra piece. And so I, I can only cut down to a two inch board. And uh, man, what a mighty board this is too. This thing is heavy. Uh, I could, I might could lay it up and the weight of the board might uh, let it cut, but I don't want to, I don't want to get chance uh, tangling it up. So we get a nice uh, two inch board here. Bench. Another bench. Bench rich. That's what I'm talking about. So it'll go to good use. I'm sure of it. All right. All right, so we're going to get this cleaned up and get ready to put the maple in here. I got to change the blade out. The blade's kind of dull. This board had a lot of dirt on the outside of it and the bark, and it really dulled the blade down pretty fast. Plus, I didn't know what I was doing, so that's another portion of it. I like the shortness of the teeth in most cases for this tractor because it keeps the weight closer to the tractor. Uh, but there's some cases where a bigger tractor that has the ability to uh, use this as a fork might be a little bit better. But we're making do with this. I can tilt this back. Look at here, just one, one day uh, with the with the uh, sitting out here wet and it molded. Let's bleach it off. Only I don't know what to do with it. Yeah, we left those boards out for one night because it just poured rain for, well, actually two nights because it has just poured rain. I mean, just all that leftover hurricane has come through. Yeah, I don't know what these boards are gonna be good for. Project. I mean, they're pretty, got a lot of character. Two inches thick, twelve inches wide, so a two by twelve. And we'll make a bench or something, something neat out of it. There's a lot of good wood left in it. I know that. Hey, I, I really, really want to get to the maple log, but we've run out of time. We have to make sure that we stack this wood before we move on to our next project and it's already late and we're, we're going to lose daylight so uh, i just wanted to uh, let you guys know next timber tuesday we will have uh, the maples that we cut up over there uh, and then we'll, we'll keep going you guys will learn with us i also want to let you know that we just went over 20,000 subscribers uh, that's a big deal for us i mean I'm, I'm we don't really say much about how many subscribers we got anymore uh, but 20,000, that's a lot of people that are watching our channel, and I really appreciate that. I really appreciate you watching. And if you haven't subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button and the little bell notification, and that'll let you know when we put out something new. God bless, and have a great day.